When the fuel is injected into the combustion chamber of an engine, it needs to be ignited for there to be an explosion that forces the piston down. This will cause a rotation of a crankshaft, which provides enough power to accelerate machines like cars and water pumps. So how is the fuel mixture ignited? That's where the spark plug comes in. Today I'm going to discuss what materials the spark plug is made from and why. The spark plug is made up of four main components, the center electrode, a metal casing, an insulator, and a side electrode. The center electrode is commonly made from high nickel alloys or copper. Why? Depending on the usage of the engine, sometimes a cheap metal like nickel alloys or copper can be used. It also allows electricity to be conducted through the electrode in order to ignite the fuel. The metal casing is made from steel wire. It is used to remove the heat from the insulator. As the spark passes through the center electrode, the metal casing also acts as a ground. The main part of the insulator is made of porcelain, with the tips of the insulator enclosed in the combustion chamber made from aluminum oxide ceramic. Why? To avoid overheating, it must offer good thermal conductivity. The aluminum oxide ceramic is able to withstand 650 degrees Celsius of heat and 60,000 volts of electricity. The side electrode is made from high nickel steel, sometimes with a copper core. This is to increase heat conduction. As this part of the spark plug is located inside the combustion chamber, it has to be able to withstand high temperatures. The spark plug is vital in every engine as it is responsible for the ignition of the fuel. Without the spark plug, the engine would not be able to function. 